my name is Dan Beckley. I'm a mechanical engineer here at ARL. Third arm is a wearable, passive, stabilizing device for the dismounted soldier for their weapon. Weight is a sensitive issue for dismounted soldiers. They're already overburdened. We don't want to burden them anymore. But what we want to look at here is, is there a trade-off between any potential added weight and improved um, lethality, improved survivability. Vasquez, take point. Let's move! Move up! Hudson, run a bypass. Second squad, move up. Flanking positions. Second squad online. Right now, it's a prototype device, and it's a fairly early stage prototype device. We're using some of that interest that's gathered to help motivate further development of the device. Third arm helps take the weight of the weapon off of the, the soldier's arms. We've actually tested third arm with the M249 and M240 Bravo machine guns. The M240 Bravo weighs 27 pounds, and we were able to show that you can take the weight of that weapon completely off the soldier's arms. Just her. <laughs> 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 I do it. Oh, that's sweet. Holy that God. is so sweet. <laughs> oh man, full articulation, that's awesome. That is legit. It's really falling in line with some of the new priorities that are coming from higher up in the Army now with like the modernization effort and um, I think exoskeletons are actually explicitly mentioned in some of the, um, the priority documents from the Army. In the future, I hope that Third Arm or what we learn from Third Arm will lead to a fielded device that um, improves outcomes for the dismounted soldier, improves lethality, improves survivability. Helping the soldier is what I really hope for, for the future. <laughs> <laughs>